Long before the advent of a modern judicial system, different communities in Kenya had devised traditional ways of pushing wayward members. And in this way of punishing, how did the Abaluya community punish uh, those found to be, or rather to have committed a murder? This week on My Culture, Jackie Wambiru brings us who's holler, the process of uh, banishing traditionally convicted murderers. A Tabutere village, Kukamegi County, residents have converged at one of the homesteads. This is after three houses and two vehicles were allegedly set ablaze while plants and crops were intentionally destroyed. This erupted after one of the neighbors knowingly grazed his goat at his neighbor's farm. When the owner of the farm found the tethered goat, he impounded the same and took it to his compound. It is then that the owner of the goat went to inquire on the whereabouts of his goat, only for an argument to erupt leading to a scuffle and one of them hitting the other with a djembe, allegedly killing him on the spot. <laughs> After family members learned their kin had been killed, they allegedly stormed the suspect's homestead and set ablaze the homestead. Sasa sisi kama wenye hapa hatukuwa na uwezo, hatukuwa na nguvu. Na tuliweza tukusimama kando kwa sababu hatunge hatungeweza kuingiana na hawa kuanza kufurugana nao kwa sababu walikuwa na hasira sana. Na wakichoma manyumba yako watakatakata hata miti, wakipata hapo ng'ombe watakatakata Meanwhile, at Ikolomani, Kakamega County, two new Makumi members visited a homestead of a suspected thief only to arrive and find him armed. The suspect then hacked one of them to death, while the one who escaped alerted the neighbors who then stormed his homestead and allegedly set the homestead ablaze. So the family came rowdy. And, 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 and they went to the homestead of the suspect and they touched the house. According to elders, the practice of banishment from the community dubbed Kusola is invoked in the event one takes the life of another person or they are considered murderers, which means they are seen as unclean and as such they should not share any more meals with the rest of the community members, adding that the practice is meant to deter others from committing crime. Aki fruit kukaa hapo hata kuwa na maisha maisha yake itakuwa mafupi ye pia atawawa kwa panga kwa sababu mwenye kuua kwa panga atawawa na panga the elders add that in some situations the suspect is forced to sell his land and the children advised to live with their uncles kwa kwenda kama umeua uh, bibi yake sherehe inasema ya kwamba in some instances, if the person who commits murder is caught, he can be killed by an angry mob on revenge mission. Kumkono, amwezi ruto mukakulia pamoja. Paga, ukuja uombe mzama mbele ya waze, ukija uomba mbele ya waze mzama, wadaleta dawa muta kunywa wote, alafu muendele kushirikiana pamoja kama manduku, kama achakuf. Lakini ukipata kwamba. Wewe umekata nduku yako umemtoa damu alafu unarudi unaanza kukula na yeye tena utapata hiyo damu itamwandama ndio maana hata kwa Biblia vile abe eh, Kain aliua Abel damu ya Abel ilianza kulia Mungu akauliza wapi nduku yako Kain akasema eh, sijui mahali yako akasema lazima uchunge nduku yako ndio maana hata sisi waluya tunasema ya kwamba maisha ya nduku yako ni yako the elders add that despite practicing Christianity, there are things the community must do traditionally. Individuals who participate in banishment from the community dubbed Kusola are cleansed by drinking herbs and keep a watch to ensure the person who committed murder does not sneak back into the village. <laughs>
kuangalia hiyo poma mtu asiruti tena huyo mwenye aliua mwingine asiruti kuishi pale wakunywe machi moja kwa mtoni moja aende mbali kabisa